I'm back again with another video but this time it's about my planners and journals that made it through the year 2023 so these are all until the finish line <laughs> no failed and all. I'm not including the failed ones and all so before I do my unboxing and my um, 2024 planner lineup I'd like to share with you um, my current system and a summary of what I'm gonna be using the same next year and what I'm not gonna do again the mistake or what whatever <laughs> so yes um, if you've been in my, here in my channel you've seen this quite a few times but today for those who are new um, thank you and thank you for dropping by to my channel and I hope you will subscribe this is my five year these are all my like my planners and journals that um, I have been consistently using so maybe you will get some insights and all and what to do for 2024 as well just like me so it's like an overview of the entire year this is my five year Hobonichi Tacho and I'm on to my third year or coming fourth year on 2024 so obviously I haven't missed a single day here it will carry over to 2024 so that's one book there and i'm starting with the journals right so this is my morning pages a6 hobonichi um that show the original japanese version so every day i mean monthly i put my inks here and then every day every morning i write i might miss one day or two in a month but usually these are all consistent from day one from january the only thing that was not working in this journal was this section i stopped from june and went back again in august so these are all highlights of the day but i felt like it's too tight too tiny and redundant with my weekly um another weekly from my traveler's notebook so i just um randomly date day time you know and weather somehow and a sticker here and there so it's just a very simple one but i'm not gonna carry this over next year i don't have an a6 next year to separate my uh, morning pages alone i'm gonna do it in one book so wish me luck so yeah no more a6 for 2024 breaks my heart because i'm always with a6 for the last since 2019 <laughs> but of different purpose it can be a planner a journal and you know memory keeping but this time it's a morning page which i'm not gonna do next year um this is my traveler's notebook the hotel um, limited edition and this has been my monthly and my weekly memory keeping so i've added this insert as well for ephemeras and stickers okay i closed it up and this is my one sticker a day monthly which i've consistently been doing and my weekly memory keeping so this is my daily before i got my cousin uh, hybrid so it's going again next year we i'm gonna use the same um inserts and you know planners uh books inside but of a different purpose so it's going to be my main planner i'm gonna elaborate on that more when i will do the setup for 2024 but yes i'm gonna have this same traveler's notebook um regular size uh when it comes to cover i'm not sure but for sure i i ordered the inserts so stay tuned i'm gonna do my uh setup video for that and last journal i have here is my recently i mean not recently i started july and it will also end maybe uh, let's see which month um, february or march because this is a spring edition 
but I doubt it if I will continue after December because I ordered a cousin so I will have that book and so this hybrid although I love the cousin and I love the experimentation on this um, as much as I'd like to use this up it's um, I'm gonna combine my morning pages together in the cousin so I need that space I'm gonna talk more on that in my next coming video so don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell bell there so you will be notified planners planners I have three here <laughs> so this is my everyday carry you must be seeing this a lot with my food with my coffee because <laughs> this goes wherever I go in indoor outdoor house outside it's always with me and this is my work planner my um, tra take a note a6 and this is my inbox my commonplace book I'll start with this one first so this is a large term daily um, supposed to be a bullet journal you know you cannot call this bullet journal because it's dated obviously but this is where I jot down all combination of work and um, home so there's this um, personal stuff there's this YouTube stuff there's this work stuff anything that I can like middle of the night I randomly thought of something I write it here that's why I call this a commonplace book but on a daily basis I know I was I got a comment before that commonplace book should be like a ongoing but I use this mind differently and I really really love this uh, launch term but practicality wise um, it's difficult I have to pre-order this and or um, the pricing as well so as you all know I have my replacement for this for next month I mean next year which is the sequence which is um, see that nail that matches my notebook I, I will start with this this is not data this is just that great with a bigger dot guide so hopefully it can replace my love for Lostrum but anyway if I really really like to have this I can just order it anytime but this one is lined okay so I'm gonna start with that and I don't have to waste pages if it's not uh, there's nothing to do or I went out then I can use that because this one is dated then there's no point but with this there's no date obviously I can utilize all the spacing so this is not going coming with me for 2024 but the process the system inbox system commonplace is still gonna be there okay and my work um, my work planner is my take a note a6 now I have realized this is picture I realized that I'm running out of space most of the time if there are no that would be weekend but work wise it's always filled okay so i thought that i will order the a5 for next year oh, actually i already ordered so this a6 is gonna upgrade a little bit to a5 and because um i can also do both i i'm a social media manager so i have a few clients that i can also plan see it's very tight this is very small for me so i need a bigger square there planning my client social media not mine mine will be on a separate book that i just featured last time on this so this is where i will jot down all my my personal social media this one the a take a note a5 is for my work so this one planner there and last but not the least the everyday carry i will still have an everyday carry because this is where i put my random uh, schedule budgets you know planning and 
scheduling be it school kids stuff so i will have to segregate next year like you know plan properly wherein my cousin monthly and this monthly won't be redundant i will do my best that this is will all be for um budgets finances and since i carry this everywhere i go most likely my schedule so i refer to this first i won't be carrying my inbox whenever i go for scheduling because obviously there's no calendar on that so on in here in this i have the the weekly and the monthly and this is where i log also my um orders online so this is actually the main planner but like i said i will elaborate more on my next coming videos for my 2024 lineup for now i can say that um five to six books is there but two are consistent so if i have a morning pages separate before so it would be minus two books this time two or one yeah so that's it guys um i'm creating this video for the purpose of my documentation as well that there's no need for me to get an a6 or an a5 um uh, weeks this this three will be retiring next year i'm down to this only okay and yeah let me know what are your plans i think i've watched a few videos already of their 2023 planner talks and what they're doing for 2024 so stay tuned on my next videos this month are all about what i will use for 2024 and my planner lineup and hopefully set up the thing is i really really like to do plan with me videos but since i'm using just my phone and the memory and all this <laughs> i will do my best to get a camera and film you know um plan with me is like not to give you a longer video but to give you a better quality i, I don't find this phone quality so much uh, good when i do plan with me so i want to give you more of that next year hopefully if you subscribe to my channel and um in return that's what i will i promise to do to give you more content that we are in line in line with our hobbies so that's it thank you guys for staying around uh, for this video and i hope to see you on my next one don't forget to like and subscribe bye